Hey boys, I escaped with the money in China, dude. Hell yeah, now let's Alt F4 and not play this game for a while. Jesus Christ, this fucking hurts to play. God damn. What is that? What is that shit? Nice guys, right? I love this Reddit board, dude. I love this Reddit board beyond belief. This is like the fucking greatest board ever created by mankind. Cause it's just, it's just like, it's just insane, dude. Anyways, let's get, let's get reading over here. Um, random Instagram friend some sends me sexual message. I shut it down and I get this, uh, posted on a story. Oh fuck. All right. You ready boys? To be honest, some girls shouldn't be complimented cause they just put you on blast for being honest, sweet and straightforward. Like that's why your dumbass is single. Not all guys are the same. Why is he in like the back seat of a f fucking car? It's like I'm looking at a 12 year old being taken to a soccer game. What the fuck? Do I get the Charlie drink or the or the Travis Scott burger? Oh, dude, you get you get that Travis Scott burger. We gotta watch that, by the way. So next time, don't be a bitch when a guy sends you a cute DM. Just talk with him and see how he is and his personality. Communication is everything. And the reason y'all get dick pics is because your page is either slutty or misleading. It's the hard truth. I mean, I think it's more truthful that the guy has, like, a fucking social, like, issue. Like, I think I think the guy is fucking batshit insane. Don't send your dick pics to random girls on the internet, dude. That shit's fucking cringe, dog. I'm just gonna be real with you. That's fucking weird. My friend got a text from someone that knew her in high school after building a bit of a following. Oh. Oh, TikTok? Oh, fuck me, boys. I saw you on TikTok and asked... Oh, Nate, for it. Honestly, I have always had a crush on you since high school. Omega oh, lol, dude! Oh, man. that was Kane and Lynch too. I played Omega oh, fucking lol, boys. Look at the three, like, fucking laugh emojis. Dude, that's... That's how, that's how you know that's how you know you fuck, dude. What's funny? I really liked you this whole time. So let me get this straight. You've liked me for a literal 10 years. Is it so hard for like some people to use the word fucking decade? But didn't tell me that you found me on TikTok and realized I was getting a following on there. You're not we're not even FB friends. You're a joke. <laughs> okay. I don't know who's more cringe, this or that. That's fucking we're not even FB friends. God damn. Fuck you, you guckin' um, whore, okay? No one even liked you in high school. You were fucking weird, dumb slut. People only follow you because they want you to die. Oh my god! What the fuck, man? This dude's consuming the cum chalice. Lamau, I wouldn't touch you with my dick if you were the last girl on earth. <laughs> you had no friends in high school. I'm surprised you didn't KY Oh my fucking god, dude, what the hell? What are the chances of you to prison spread on YouTube live? A prison spread? I don't know if I'm gonna eat, like, what are you talking about? Like, what's a prison spread? What the hell? I can't... <laughs> no, I will not try prison food. <laughs> That's just terribly bad. <laughs> but thank you for the tenor, dude. Have I tried the new Travis... I haven't tried the Travis Scott... Is it in Canada? If it's in Canada, I'll try the Travis Scott meal. Kidnapping is fine, right? What do girls like to do? What do girls like doing for dates? Should I take her out to a decent restaurant? It's our two-year anniversary. I need help. Wait, how do you have a girlfriend for two years when you were just being obsessive creepy over your crush like 20 days ago? She is way different from all the loud and rude girls at my school. She isn't shallow and vapid like most of the females there. How much do you want to bet that's like his fucking counselor? Like, that's like, it's like the counselor they got her. Or him. Prison spread is a meal from Mexico? I'll try it. You see, you see, you see it seems like I'm going to get fucked in a prison. It seems like a prison cell food. Like, I don't know. Uh, I sometimes want to switch my right eyeball with her so that we could be a part of each other. Every single day, I picture our lives to... Girls. 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 If... And guys, if your significant other ever says that shit about you, I'm gonna tell you, run! Fucking run, dude! I run all night and day! Couldn't get it! You gotta fucking run, dude! You gotta fucking run! 
Holy shit, artistically. Thank you for the 200 bucks. Goddamn, starting my September game early. September game early? Daddy Muda? Lenny face? God fucking damn it. God damn. You came into the right time when I was telling the audience they got to run all night and day. Couldn't get away. <laughs> they're, they're fucking insane. These, these motherfuckers are insane. It's such a shame that she has some drooling mutt. What did some dirty mutt have that I don't... Life is so unfair like that. A random dog can get her heart, but a good person like me gets ignored? Max was like, last time we spoke, I asked you about the military. I'm choosing my job, and I think I had it for others and you. I would have not continued. Dude, big congrats to Max for making it through, making it into his fucking army and getting that fucking bread, dog. Got COVID on week two in my first year in college. Oh, goddamn. That's, uh, that's bad. Hope you make it through, buddy. Caleb is like only a spoonful. Yeah. James is always like, you gotta, you gotta admit though, the trend is of latest for girls to be unnecessarily mean by default. I'll be real, man. If a girl was like super mean to me and I was just like nice to her, like I was just like, how's it going? And she was like, fuck you, bitch. I have a boyfriend. I would have been like. I would I would have got the fucking traffic cones. I would have set them around me and be like, "All right, boys, stay away from the potential train wreck here." Okay, goddamn. Like, if you're nice to a girl and she tells you and she like very meanly says, "I have a boyfriend." Okay, not even like, "Oh, I, I'm with someone." If she's n mean to you and all you do is that, carry a bunch of traffic cones, set them around you, and be like, "Okay, gotta step back. There's a fucking train wreck inbound." Captain UAV is <laughs> you know what I mean? You gotta step back. Thank you, Bacon Boy, for being a new member. The only dude I kidnap is Papa <laughs> Yeah, man. Fuck yeah, dude. You don't have to donate for me saying E. I'll say E all the time. I know you guys are fucking spamming that shit. Probably caused it more anyways. Anyways, uh let's uh let's get out of here. This is um this this, this person's gonna get arrested one day. I'm sorry, I'm not in the guy's nice guy. I can fix that. All women are prostitutes because their SO chooses... What? Ironically, most women are technically prostitutes. They just... Yo, this is some fucking mega hot take right here. They just don't accept cash. Payment is done via flowers, dinners, and the expensive ones, cars, jewelry, and houses. Holy shit, boys. Holy shit, boys. Shout out to the resident who died at war. Oh, goddamn, Gray. That's sad. Salami lid. <laughs> Stop, mangoes. God damn it. Salami lid. God, dude. That's fuck. That was in r slash jokes. Sounds like a fucking political statement to me there. This dude's like fucking... This dude, this dude believes it hard. God damn. I thought I saw his dick for a second. I want to fuck. Lol, I don't. What? What do you mean? What? Do this? That's just fucking weird, dude. Why are people so weird? Especially on the internet. Like, just go, just go, just, just stop being fucking weird. Is it hard to not be weird? Like, one in the chat. Is it hard to not be weird? Or two, these people are just fucking weird. These people are just, these people are in cells. I don't think it's a one, I think it's a two. I don't even take the time to respond. Sucks being a good dude in a generation full of girls who don't even appreciate it. Yikes! Yikes. What's the nice girls Reddit? I gotta see this one. The nice girls is fucking just as cringe. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy. Showed up on my Facebook. I hate that people really think this way. I like 50-50 in a relationship. He buys the movie tickets. I buy my outfit. He buys the flight tickets. Hotel. I buy a neck pillow for the flight. He buys the house. I buy the new home celebration cake. It's maturity in a relationship. What? Are you fucking out of your mind? Are you out of your mind, motherfucker? Okay, fine. Movie tickets. I could... Your outfit? I don't give a fuck. You're spending 50-50 on the movie tickets. If you go naked to the fucking movie theater, that's on you. But we're so actually, okay, fine. I'll concede. I probably buy the movie tickets. They're not fucking terribly that expensive either. Cool, whatever. But a goddamn flight ticket hotel? 
Are you fucking out of your mind? You know how expensive flight tickets and hotels are? Okay, if I'm if I'm spending the lion share of my cash, if I'm spending the money on a fucking hotel <laughs> and a flight ticket, I'm buying my own flight ticket and I'm buying the nicest goddamn hotel for me. He buys the house. I bet you know how expensive fucking house is? You know how expensive a fucking bitch we we share in the rent on a cardboard box if you're willing to go that way. God damn. If you're not if you're not paying a bit for the house, there's the door. I know it's satire though, it's great. The satire it is satire, but like it's great. All these people over there. I mean, if people believe like that, believe like it, but like this is this is this is just some parody shit. If I can't marry this boy, I'll ruin his wedding. Are you fucking dumb? Lamau. Lamau boys. La fucking Mao. Alright, let's uh let's go. Let's uh, let's go down a little bit more and try to find some absolute psycho. Thank you, Linkus. You said piss for twenty five. <laughs> piss? You like piss? You like a little golden fucking shower? I'm down for golden showers. Fuck it, dude. Golden showers are kind of hot. Nice girls try to make me break up with my GF. What? Oh man, we gotta read that shit. What is what is this fucking hell? Hey, Sophie, your post looks cute. Thanks. Do you think I'm cute? I'd love it if you do. Ah, uh, you look all right, I guess. <laughs> what a fucking chat. All right. Yeah. Okay, then. Are you single? No. Well, I'm surely better than that person. Not assuming genders. They're probably a skank. What? What? They're probably a skank. I love that. Like, if you wanted me to be on your side, the first thing you do is call my significant other a whore. Good job. So you won't assume someone's gender, but you're going to assume you're better than them, and that's kind of a shitty thing to do. Oh, come on. It's obvious. Ha! 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 I'm sure you'd be happier with me. Dude, I don't even know you. I'm Sophie. That's not what I meant, and you fucking know it. <laughs> I love this dude. He's good. He's like Kazuma Kiryu trying to like tell a bitch to fuck off. Oh, come on. Just forget that skank. Look, I'm not going to ditch my girlfriend because some random person I don't even know thinks she's better than someone she's never even met. Oh, so it's a girl. Yeah, I bet she's super fat. Probably can't find clothes that fit her. You know what? That's called more to love, motherfucker. <laughs> what the hell, dude? That's so mean. Dark mode, please. All right, I switched to dark mode. I'm sorry if I'm burning your eyes. She's really trying, though. She's kind of like... I feel like she's a fucking troll, dude. Even if... She, she, so she called his girlfriend a fucking porker. Even if she was, that wouldn't matter. Why? If she's fat, what's the point? Mm. Goddamn. Red really fits you. Thank you. Because she's not some bitch that goes around assuming things about people. Oh, I bet she's so nice. Yeah? Yeah, right. She's nicer than you. I bet she's some dumb need in over her head. Some? She probably doesn't even know what sex is. Bro, I'm 14. Do you really think I care? Of what the fuck? <laughs> I'm 15. I know what people our age think about him. <laughs> and he's got the SpongeBob text. I know what people our age think about you clearly don't. All right, you can fuck off now. The answer is an absolute no. It almost means you again. Oh, blah, blah. So scary. What she got that I haven't? A good personality. Fucking GG, boys. Well played. It's all over. It's all over. GG, well, you can't fucking... She, she, he won. He won. He put, he put her in a fucking place. He won. I'm good for him, dude. He won. God bless. God bless. That, that, that's, how, that's how it fucking works, dude. People are sharing like... Don't, you'll never, dude, you'll never find somebody worth your life on Tinder, okay? You'll never find somebody marriage material on Tinder. All they want to do is fuck, okay? All they want to do, I've never gotten a match on Tinder, okay? Maybe I'm a little mad. Maybe I've got the fucking ugly, but I've never been matched I'm, at all. And it kind of sucks. I'm a gamer plus a funny girl. What else do you want? I'm a gamer, dude. I'm a fucking gamer, dude. Do I have a girlfriend? Nah, dude, I'm... Like I said, boys, I'm fucking ugly, okay? I have no girlfriend. I am a single fucking man, all right? I am a single man. That's the... I, I've got the ugly, boys. Tortu's like, I love you. <laughs> Give me that Hindi talk, baby. I love... Goddamn.
Middle of the content. Can't wait for the next Deep Web Browsing. Overload. Thank you. Flaming Goodness. If you fought Moist Critical, who would win it? Well, we're doing co-op Kane and Lynch this weekend, so look forward to that. Maybe we might actually fight over a stupid game like that. What is somebody writing, writing over here? I bet your girlfriend... I'll be your girlfriend. Stop playing. Dude, I'm fucking single, boys. I'm single. All right, goddamn. I've got that fucking ugly. Ah. That's why your dad believes you're not married, God it, King. Damn straight, dude. I've got I've got that single life, but it's fine. It is it is what it is. All right, I don't care too much for it. I actually prefer the single life, boys. I'll be real with you. I God prefer damn. the goddamn single life. What are you talking about? Okay, this, you know, the, the, the nice girls Reddit isn't actually funny. It's actually kind of psychotic. Like, hey, hello, I saw your thing on Omegle, and you really hot. Thank you. NP, you got a girlfriend? I do, actually. Oh, honestly, you look a little gay. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> That, uh, that, uh, that escalated a little quickly, dude. <laughs> you got a girlfriend? Yeah, dude. Well, I don't want to, like, alarm you, but you look a little gay, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? That, that's like a... <laughs> oh, shit. I would have been like, thank you, dude. Thank you. Goddamn. If a fat woman wants to have sex with you, have sex with her. What? Listen up, men. If a fat woman approaches you and wants to have sex with you, you have sex with her. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. First of all, you should be fucking honored as shit to have the opportunity to have sex with a big, beautiful goddess. More importantly, you have to oblige, as she says, because if you say no, you are actively oppressing her with your bullshit, ridiculous standards of beauty. And let's face it, what you think is beautiful doesn't fucking matter. Because she can be as fat as she wants, it's her body, not yours. By oppressing her with your fat, phobic bullshit, though, you are likely going to be triggering her and thus violating her and her identity. And by violating her so viciously like that, you are in fact committing... Oh my god, what the fuck did I just read? Holy shit. Fancy torchics, like five bucks, never call myself ugly. Okay, fine, fine. Vis vi 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 visually disgusting. Have you been dumbed? Then I have. That's when that meme first came out, I saw my face in that. You gotta put him down like old yeller. <laughs> Trap card activated, <laughs> Randy Flat. Dude. Dude, that's fucking scary. Dude, that, dude, this has to be Facebook. This is so stupid. This is Facebook. I'm gonna bet you... Uh, I'm gonna bet you fucking 20 bucks. This shit's Facebook. But it's obvious satire, so... Uh, if you see this on Facebook, it's fucking hilarious. That's funny, though. That is fucking hilarious. That is fucking hilarious. She is a paradox. She is faithful and yet detached. She is committed and yet relaxed. She loves everyone and yet no one. She is sociable. She is also a loner. She is gentle and yet tough. This is just like smooth brain shit. I, I'm not going to do it. Thank you, Death, for the 800. Kaise ho, bhai? Thoda sa rupia lelo. Shukriya, bhai. Shukriya. My God. When you guys get me to speak Hindi, okay? Like, I literally, like, I have to stop. Because I... Nowadays, I don't know what's going on, but I just can't fluently switch as fast as I used to. Or maybe it, like, freaks me the fuck out a little bit. Do men ever think, damn, she's been through a lot. Let me show her something different and treat her like a queen. Bro, the only the only the only queen for me is good old Dairy Queen dog. Let me tell you, Dairy Queen. Dairy Queen's the shit. Okay. I'm just gonna tell you, Dairy Queen? That that be the shit. Alright, let's go. Do you ever just get jealous so easily? Like, no, that person is mine. Don't breathe around them, please, and thank you. Nope. No, I don't. No, no, I don't. No. Yeah, that's fucking scary. What's this? Well, I don't know how much of this I can... I hate a gamer word who thinks he played me, but hold up. Who ended up losing? It, it, for, it for sure wasn't me. I mean, what the, what the fuck did I lose? 
uh, that no doubt didn't appreciate me, okay? Now, what did you let go? A female that would go out of her way <laughs> just to please you. Someone who would uh, ride with you. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? Wait. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <clears throat> <clears throat> a female that would go out of her way just to please you, someone who would ride with you through thick and thin and even thinner, a female who would unconditionally love you and accept all your flaws and insecurities can be so easily replaced, but a female like me, it gonna be hard to find, not gonna lie. I put up with the bullshit you bring and still stuck with you. Sorry, but you played yourself... If I, listen, 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 motherfucker. If someone cheats on you, okay, good. That means you're free, bitch. Go home, pools closed, party like it's 1999. They saved you time and That's what's going to happen. I saw so many Reddit posts about communicating over ghosting. Ah, uh, no. Oh, this is a Facebook one? Oh, shit. What kind of a girl would be comfortable lying down half naked in public for two hours while some fat dude... With a dirty beard, jarms a sharp needle into her skin. Answer, the kind of girl who takes sharp object, objects in her vagina as a hobby. Girls with tattoos and or piercings, aside from earrings, are slags who fall in and out of guys' beds at a moment's notice. If you're unfortunate enough to commit to a girl with ink on her body or metal in her face, she'll cheat on you at the drop of a hat. Tattoos and piercings are the mark of a whore. Oh my god. Woo! Thank you. Stop asking great. me to change my name. Cats are really great. She's so different. She lifts unlike the other girls at the gym who come so Chad will hit on them. My god, dude. Some of these chicks are kind of kind of kind of insane, dude. Kind of like kind of like ready. Why Okay, wait. So this is what I don't I don't get this, okay? You have an entire board called nice girls, right? You have an entire board called nice guys. Why don't we make another board where we just literally sit down and like match make these people with each other? Cause like, here's the thing. If you have all these like nice girls and you have all those nice guys, why not just get them to fucking like be with each other? Like that, that seems like dude, like mathematically that would be the smartest fucking thing you got to do. Like, if I was... Dude, if I ran a YouTube dating show idea, that's my fucking idea. If I ran a dating show, I'd get the nice guys and the nice girls. It's like 60 Day Fiance, but you know their fucking relationship isn't going to last more than six hours. That's what I would do. I would, Dude, I think I'd be a gangster matchmaker. 100%. Like, I'd be looking at... I'd, be, I'd get, like, a pair of, like, people to, like, scientifically quantify how batshit insane each person is. And then matchmake them together, dude. And then, like, there would, like, I would probably put in fine print all the relationships I make have, like, a 2% chance of success. <laughs> nice girls meet nice guys. I think, dude, I'd be fucking amazing, dude. 60 day fiance. Get out of here, bro. Six hour relationship right here. That's my fucking idea. That's my fucking idea. I probably didn't make it. Haunted dating. That's my idea right there. That's literally my idea. I'm a. F it's not a. Hor it's not a horrible idea, okay? Because here's the thing. It's it's not, okay? You, you, dude, they dude. I swear, Elliot Roger and Whitney Wisconsin match. Yeah, it's dude. I swear it's a good idea. I promise you, it's a good idea.